size, it will be, my judgment is we need digital, we need big data, we need innovation. I think we need to do this in the future. Anybody can think that. Give me the numbers, the data, the market data, the problems, the issues, where our customers are. Give me the, the meat. <laughs> Otherwise, shut up. A lot of what you want to see in change is triggered by discomfort, problems. I have a problem here, I have a problem here, I have a problem here, I have a problem here. So eventually, you talk about a lot of problems. You can see those problems. Right? Value, quality, internal problems. Most of what you're seeing actually is much, very much like if you go to a doctor and you say, <clears throat> I have a problem with my lungs. He says, okay, go see a specialist on the lungs. And you come back the next day and he says, I seem to have some problem with my skin. And he says, go see a skin specialist. And the skin specialist gives you med another medication. And you seem to have some problem with your heart. And you go to your doctor and he says, go see a heart specialist. And he gives you a medication for your heart. <laughs> You see where I'm going? And you have some problem with your legs, they are tingling. You go and talk about your legs and your doctor says, let's go to a foot specialist. So you see a whatever, podolog, something like that. And then the next foot starts and this one stops and there, and you're really worried, you go see your doctor and he gives you some uh, medication for depression. <laughs> okay. So that's doctor number one. So doctor number two, which is you, much smarter. What should he do? Diagnose. <coughs> Diagnose. So you go see a specialist, take your blood pressure, go see a specialist, go to your heart pressure, go see a specialist on all of that, go see, let's get some blood samples, let's analyze all of this, and here's all the data. Dr. House. Dr. House. <laughs> <laughs> he puts all the data, scratches his head, and then he comes back with one simple thing. I think you have too much sugar. Solution, you need to cut down on sugar. Because everything is linked to it. Today, we're doing problems, problems, solutions, solutions. So, you know, your manager says, don't give me problems, give me solutions. Uh-uh. Give me only one core problem. So forget this, give me solutions. We have too many solutions. You have too many projects. It's garbage. Because you're not addressing the core problem. So don't give me a lot of problems. These are symptoms. Give me the core problem. That forces you to think. Get that? So all of the problems you're coming out with examples should have at the core the core problem. This is, this, what is, okay, we have too much sugar? Here's a core change. How do we decrease sugar? We're gonna look at how much sugar you take. We're gonna test how you assimilate sugar. You, we're gonna put you on a diet and you're gonna start jogging and all the other medication will be finished. And we may eliminate medication. So when you change, the question is, what is it you want to change? You want to change a culture. OK, in the culture, what is it you want to change and why? You don't change a culture. You begin to change one 
particular element in one culture, one particular behavior. Right? When you change a procedure, you have to be very precise. But what is the problem that you measure? If you measure just sugar, it's far better than measuring your legs, your lungs, your heart, your depression, all of this nonsense. You see? So, what is the problem addressed by connected objects? What is the problem addressed by lean management systems? What is problem related to innovation? What is the problem related to the topics you're studying? Right? 